know, this movie looked like it was just a lot of fun to work on. Um, talk about just being in character and kind of just being on set and having fun with your castmates. It was pretty ridiculous. I mean, I think I think there's a I, I had several several many 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 times where I just thought if what's happening right now if I could have described to myself growing up that this would be my job mm -hmm. as we were like laughing and crying or somebody <laughs> yes. was doing something like totally stupid and wasting time in a great way. I was like, "Oh my god, this is my job." Like, I'm actually at work. Wow. I'm being productive. Although we're ruining takes because <laughs> Leslie keeps saying crazy stuff and making me laugh. But I don't know, it just kind of felt like that the whole way through it. Like the four of us, I mean, we've all known each other. I mean, Chris and I have known each other forever, but. To live in a dream. Uh, yeah, it's a kind of, I think we all kind of felt it and would have different things of like, we're actually doing this right. and yeah. it's really fun and we're ripping around town in, a, in the Ecto One. Like, what? What's happening? Right. What else could you ask yeah. for? Yeah. You know, when it comes to these, these characters, there's a certain element of like um, defiance when it comes to them breaking the rules and going out there and accomplishing their tasks. Uh, but you know, when female comedians often defy, you know, the odds in a lot of ways, they're often looked at as like crazy, or over the top. So when it comes to kind of like defeating and, and defying the stigma that are often surrounding female comedians, how do you go about kind of just you know. I, I absolutely pay no attention to it. I think it's the strongest thing I can do. Because I think, I think the second you start to try to justify it, you're already caught up, you're already caught up in the muck and mire of it, where it's like, what we should, what shouldn't be happening is nobody should be mentioning it. Hmm. I mean, because it, it really is the same thing of like, you know, I went into a store the other day and a woman was hmm. working the cash register. It's can't like, it. <laughs> what, what? Like, why is that, why is that shocking? So what, I think I look forward to when we, I think anytime somebody kind of shields, shields out all the negativity and stays the course, mm -hmm. I love them for that. I love it in people, I love it in characters. Absolutely. And I think the more people do that in life, and on the screen, I think it's like nothing is more heroic or fun to watch than than some character that just absolutely is like, you can you can make fun of me, you can say everything you want, I know in my heart this is right. right. Like when you watch someone defy people saying what they should and shouldn't do, mm -hmm. it's like my, my heart swells like when I see that. Absolutely. And I think that happens in this movie. It's four completely unlikely heroes. Yeah, that's what's special about it too. I and mean, people have, Ghostbusters has a special place with a lot of people. So when yeah. it comes to everybody's opinions, and I don't want to say the negative ones, but you know, some people are really passionate about the story that's being told. So how do you kind of just like block out the noise and just as an actor, just, as an actor, just kind of. I mean, it, it, it does, it looms large for a lot of people. I think what's interesting is it, it looms large for all of us that made it. I mean, no, no one was probably more protective and and, and worried about like, are we gonna do it justice than the people making it. So it comes from such a place of love and admiration and it's okay if somebody's like, don't mess it up. Like right. I, I, I know when it's like, you know, it's like when getting a band back together, you're like, oh, please, <laughs> please don't come out with that last album that's gonna break my heart. But like when you do it and you do it justice and you, you make everybody proud, it's like, that's just supposed to f be fun. It's just supposed to be fun. It was. I think the audience will love this one, and uh, we look forward for more of your work. So thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you.